Welcome back to Shooter's Kitchen. Today, I'm doing a Jamaican delicacy, okay? Doing some salt fish and aki. Oh, whoa, whoa, what are you, a trini? Or something? Aki and salt fish, babe. It doesn't fucking matter. Salt fish and aki. Aki and salt fish! Salt fish and aki. Why do you keep saying the same thing? Because I'm saying it how I want to say it. I don't care how you say it. Babe, that's like saying oxtails. And that's like saying chicken curry. <laughs> Oxtails. Oxtails. Rotis. Run up, freaks. Ingredients. Ingredient list. Not your wife's water bottle. Yeah, what are you doing? That's mine. That's not a... Scallion. Scallion. Roma tomatoes. Or any type of tomato you like. One hair can catch onion. Some bell peppers. Whatever color you want. Whatever color makes you feel good inside. We don't discriminate. Fresh thyme. I got thyme cook. today, cuz. <laughs> and one scotch bonnet. Any color you like, cuz it's all the same thing. So That's for our selfish and ackee. Dumpling. We got margarine, cuz we don't eat butter in my house. The lies. <laughs> Salt. Oh my gosh. Flour. Baking powder. Vegetable oil. Can you say baking powder in French? Poudre. Poudre. Poudre a pat. <laughs> oh. <laughs> the main ingredient. <laughs> Salt fish well, is the main ingredient. It's in the pot right now because you soak it overnight in water and then you take it out and boil it for about 20 minutes. Simmer it for 20 minutes. And we'll get to that after. So for your dumpling, you're going to get a bowl. Get a bowl and start with your ingredients. I'm gonna do four cups of flour. Because who doesn't love dumpling? Four cups of flour. Boom, bim, bam. Two teaspoons of baking powder. You can just probably freestyle this if you're Jamaican, but I'm gonna follow the recipe. Like in a gray, that's where I have a I'm gonna do a teaspoon and a half of salt. Half a cup of butter, margarine, doesn't really matter. Butter's always better. Taste wise, back in it, great. That's what I have a thing, baby. Half a cup of butter, slash margarine, slash whatever you want to do. And you're gonna get your pan. Put some oil in it before you start mixing that. Just cause that's how we're doing it here in Shooter's Kitchen today. You don't need to fill it up cause you're not deep frying. Splooge. I'm just gonna put that over there on my stove top. I'm gonna mix this up with a fork. <laughs> Forgot an ingredient. Half a cup of water. Cold water. Ice cold water. <laughs> mixing it, mixing it. Like, why? What's going on here? I'm like, how is this possibly gonna turn into a dope? gonna mix that up, you know? Real thing, eh? I need some more water. Keep adding cold water till it's the consistency of what it's about to be in this video. Do you need something? <laughs> you need to run up. <laughs> so you need to do. But this flaky thing, this is a good texture. You wanna have that flakiness. Uh, I need to make a need joke, babe. What don't you, babe? Why not? Because I don't need to. Your face is not in the camera. Because my camera woman is slacking on the job. I'm slacking. Fireman's face is not in the camera. Because you're kneading dough. So? So I'm getting it. They got it close up already. It's like they get it. Okay, but what are you, you're not doing, you know, like what you're What if something happens? Like what? So are you going to lose the eyeballs going to fall into the thing? Exactly. Like, who cares? I don't want to see that anyway. I hate working with flour dough and anything of the sort. You can do it, put your back into it. Okay, 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 okay. I just left your kitchen, got some flour on me. Yeah, look at your shirt. Tell us about your shirt, mate. I don't need to tell them about my shirt. The real people, They're, them, oh, of course. they know what this is. They know that this means business. I'm the last Uchiha. Oh my gosh. 
You're a real life nerd, eh? I never met a hood man nerd in my life. Except for you. You're, the, you never you're been to one of one, Maria. <laughs> I don't know nobody like you. I never been to where? Where have I never been? to like? hood man's house when he's just chilling. <laughs> you always see them on the road, but you don't see them when they're at home. <laughs> watching Dragon Ball Z. You're like Denzel Curry. Naruto. You're out of control. Whatever, this is where our dough's at. This is where it's gonna be. And this is what it is. I don't know how this guy ever expected us to get to this point with a half a cup of water. His cup must be big. And now while that sits and chills and chills and sits. Oh my gosh, his kitchen always makes the kitchen a freaking mess. I can see it happening kitchen. already. Leaves the kitchen in shambles every shambles. time. Shambles. My mom always has to come fix it. About to chop up the scallions, the tomatoes, the red and yellow pepper, and this onion. All fast mo. And the scotch bonnet. Fast mo. Fast mo. Are you guys ready? Oh. Fast mo. Dunno, we're back. We're back, you don't know. We never left. We're back. I forgot we never left. Because usually I leave in Shooter's Kitchens and come back because something's cooking. We're back. I'm gonna get my oil heating up while I start this other process. My uh soft fish and ackee technique right here. Oh yeah, one thing quick thing before we start. This is very delicate. We're gonna take this out of the can, we're gonna put it in a strainer, we're gonna rinse it under cold water very, very carefully so it doesn't break up. Because you don't want your ackee and sawfish to be mush. mush. How do you feel about mushy saltfish and ackee, babe? I don't you know. might get sick. Ugh. Rip. I don't know what that is. Pro tip of the day. If you're in Jamaica or something and you have an ackee plant over here, so that's up. You can't just pick the thing and eat it. I know you're not trying to give Jamaican some pro tips. You're right? gonna die. <laughs> These are poisonous if you pick them at the wrong time of the year. And I think the black bulb in the middle is also poisonous, but I'm not an Aki professional, so I don't know. Just don't, don't be, if you're in Jamaica watching Shooter's Kitchen right now, and you're walking and you say, Hey, that's the Aki from the Shooter's Kitchen video, and you just try to fuck one off and eat it, you're gonna die. All I've grown up, I never knew what Aki was. Like, it was a complete mystery to me, like, what this yellow object was. I had no idea what this was. Those nasty preservatives off of there, you know? Put my yellow ackee and my yellow bowl. This is what it looks like. And you want to keep it in this form as much as you can. It goes in right at the end of your cooking. That's the ackee. I'll show, I'll show you what to do with that. Now we start to cook. Are you going to come over or are you going to just bring the tripod over? You can use any type of oil, but olive oil is supposedly the best. So that's what we're doing here today, olive oil. Let that heat up. Our pan's hot. Pan's hot. Man's not hot, but pan's hot. We're gonna start by putting in our onions, scallion, and scotch bonnet. And let that sizzle up a little bit. Oh, man's forgot something. Let me forget. Garlic. One little teaspoon of minced garlic. Not too much, but the shit, shit's strong, bro. Hey. So at this point, you're gonna take your salt fish out of the water. You're just gonna dry it, squeeze it dry, get all that water out of there. You don't want no watery, yucky, and salt fish, bro. 
Why are you giving them a live preview? Because now they don't have to go watch. Of course they do. You can chop this up or just rip it up. I'm going to rip it up because that's how I fuck with my salt fish. Are you guys still going to watch the Shooter's Kitchen? Fucking better. Yeah. Fucking better. It should be up later tonight. Sexiness. You don't need to add no salt to this because the salt fish is salty. <laughs> Get me. Peppers, tomatoes. You don't have to do the peppers if you don't want to, but that's how we do. And you don't have to be us. And then some thyme. All stem and all. I hate when you put my camera directly over the fucking. It gives me so much anxiety. Oh my god. You're gonna get your dumplings, because that takes, you want the, the peppers and tomatoes to soften up. Because you know you like your acting selfish soft. You don't want a hard acting selfish, that's not cool. You're gonna grab your dumpling dough and just make little dumplings, you know? You're a real yad man, eh? <laughs> Why? <laughs> because you're out here making acting fucking selfish and dumpling, like what? What's going just on? You're gonna make some little dumpling, you know? A dumpling patty. Tell us about the first time you made dumpling. First time I made dumpling? Do you remember? Because. Bougie was in Jamaica and I was jealous. <laughs> <laughs> so I made dumpling at home and just sat there and ate dumpling for dinner. No ackee, no saltfish, no nothing. Just dumpling for dinner. Rough life. Probably what single men in yard do. What? Uh, dump, dumpling for dinner. Well, you get full quick, so I don't know why not. I'll survive on some dumpling in, for dinner. So I put mad salt in them. I remember it. They, the recipe book. <laughs> they were mad salty. Oh, were they? Yeah. <laughs> so your oil's hot. Make sure you're about to start frying dumpling. Hope it's not too hot. I don't want to bun my dumpling, you know? That's not wavy. I'm going to cook dinner around 8.30. Or 8 before 30? that. That's a little late. You want to get your dumplings? Brown. That was a little too brown. That was a little. Yeah, don't worry. The first dumpling you cook always, is always, always. the darkest <laughs> Because the oil's you know, too hot, everything's too hot. Cook them for about a minute and a half on each side. So they cook on the inside too. I'm just waiting for these peppers to get mush. They're nice and soft now. Special ingredient. Gotta film it right. And now, <laughs> for the special ingredient. Aki. You gotta be gentle with them. Don't use no spatula, don't use no tongs. Ouch. <laughs> Make sure the whole thing to mix up. Mix up like some gal. So this is what your dumpling should look like when you're done. Off in the distance. It's a perfect it's dumpling. Out. <laughs> dumpling 101 here on Cheers Kitchen. I still don't know the difference between a dumpling and a festival, so someone needs to tell me. There's all the sweetness to them, and, they're like, and they have something? a different shape. They shape like unicorn horns. Like. <laughs> so boom. This is done. Take it off the heat. The ackee only needs like a minute and a half, two minutes. Or it starts to mush up. You don't want no mushy ackee in your life. It's like you don't want no mushy man in your life. <laughs> I like mush. You're mush. You're mush. <laughs> okay, You're turn mush. that off. We gotta go back over here. Shoot okay it. guys, gotta go. See you never. Welcome back to Shooter's Kitchen. I never, I never left, but I'm back. And since we're dealing with a national dish, Jamaica's national dish, Aki and saltfish. What were you gonna call it? I'm gonna serve it on a marble, a marble platter. <laughs> you wanna see Black Panther or what? Marble. So we got two dumplings here. The prettiest ones. Got the prettiest dumplings. I'm gonna grab some scallion for garnish. I also have to see my things you didn't use. Hmm? I also have to see my stuff getting used. Mm -hmm. right. And now, because we're pretty pretty over here, we're going to finally slice some scallion for our garnish. Pretty pretty. And now, the only reason I do Shooter's Kitchen, I got to get a slow-mo on that. What am I doing? So now, 
my favorite part of Shooter's Kitchen. I'm gonna teach you how to eat some Afghan sawfish. Don't be in the comment section talking about that's not how you make Afghan sawfish. That's not how my mama does it. And we from Jamaica. Bust your dumpling open and let it steam. Dumpling doesn't steam. You're not living right. And I grab my fork. I don't even need a fork. You can use your bare hand. I, I taste it before it goes into my mouth. I like get memories of Aki and Sawfish. I'm not even from Jamaica, I'm from Scarborough. That's how you know I'm really from Scarborough. I've been eating Aki and Sawfish my whole life. Oh, you want some of that? I don't care, just give me a piece of dumpling. And give me some Aki. I'm not coming on camera, I just want to taste it. Oh, that, that breaks apart nice. Mm -hmm. Very uh, fluffy inside. Now we're just going to get the improvement from the wife, the wifey thing. First of all, you're not going to correct wife and <laughs> wifey thing. Mmm. Mmm. It's going everywhere. Look at that piece of hockey. <laughs> My child is going to grow up on hockey and selfish for breakfast before she goes to school. Smell like dumpling. When I sent Seize to school, smell like dumpling <laughs> and selfish. Yeah, that's good. And that is another shooter's kitchen. I gotta clean this kitchen right now because I'm about to shoot another one. New Year's. Another one. Oh. Another one. Bye. Have a wonderful time.